Tonight, people in parts of South and Central Austin say the water smells so bad they've stopped using it. The problem is persisting four days after Austin Water reported dead zebra mussels are causing the odor. The city says they first invaded a pipe when it went out of service at the Auric plant on Lake Austin. When it went back online last week, the city killed them with chemicals leading to this bad smell. Today, the city is trying something new to get rid of that odor. KXAN's Alyssa Gord saw it firsthand. Sarah Kleinsmith is deciding to use bottled water to bathe her young son. We'll probably warm it up a little bit. It's the fourth day in a row that her tap water smells bad. The last couple of days, it feels like more and more people are getting involved and noticing that their water hasn't changed. The city says it's safe to drink, but just one sniff and it's easy to realize why she wouldn't want to. You know, we, we want to trust your elected officials, but if your body is telling you don't do it, like, don't do it, you know, so that's exactly, it's a visceral reaction, it's very negative. It's Austin water teams are flushing hydrants to get better smelling water in. That sent the stench of the old water through Harry Bodine's neighborhood. Yeah, you could smell it. It, it smelled a little rusty, almost like pipes. He and his wife have also been relying on bottled water since the smell started. While zebra mussels have been at the city's three water treatment plants since September, this is the first time water users are feeling the impact. Kleinsmith says the smell of her water has only gotten worse, and she hasn't heard from the city about when it will improve. As a resident, it's really making me reconsider whether or not I'd like to stay here long term, because, you know, if we can't trust the water, you know, that's just very basic. In the meantime, she's stocking up on bottled water just as she did during the city's boil water notice in the fall. Only this time it's worse because we can't do um, our laundry without it smelling and we can't take showers without smelling. Plus, she says, should she really have to pay for a water bill when she's already spent a hundred bucks working around the smelly water? Alyssa Gord, KXAN News. It's important to note that customers don't need to do anything while this flushing happens and should not affect your water bill. Austin Water says if you're experiencing odor in your water, you can send your complaints in by calling 311. And as crews work to get rid of the smell, a local startup is working to get rid of the infestation. The company is called EQO. Its founder explains the work is similar to what he's done with cancer research. He's working on a drug in the form of a microalgae. It would only target and get rid of zebra mussels specifically, not other fish. The drug could take up to two years, though, for EQO to fully develop. If you want to learn more about this process, we've put a link up on KXAN.com.